It's good morning, Wendy Lovell. Good morning, Sally. Uh, now, this is an extraordinary thing that uh, politicians could be banned from knocking on the door of any particular group. What's going on? Well, I think for a start, this needs to be ca clarified. This is not a government policy. This is actually a departmental policy. But it doesn't... It's not what, what, sorry, but what, what is the difference? Well, the department managed the estate. You run the department. But this is a departmental policy and this is... But you run the department. Policies similar to this were in, 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 um, in train when uh, Richard Wynne was the minister. The department are now just enforcing those and they have expanded them a little. Sure, but... There is no blanket ban just on knocking on public housing estates. I just want to confirm this, that you are the housing minister and you run the department. Yes. Yes, so the department uh, managed the estate. Now, the, there is no blanket ban, Sally, on knocking on public housing doors. Uh, people are welcome to um, door knock, the MPs are welcome to door knock on um, any individual housing property. There are 65,000 properties throughout the state. So individual houses, the walk-up um, estates that um, have public access, um, Richard Wynne is welcome to knock on any of those doors. The ban was made on the orders of the de the ban was made on the orders of the Department of Human Services under new rules. No, what has happened is um, the what the high rise towers have security access, swipe card access. So what has been said is that people will not be given access to secure areas. Now this is exactly the same as tenants who live in any apartment block in the city. If you lived in the Eureka Tower, you have secure access to your building. You need a swipe card to get into that building. So no one can just go... Why would the department make an order? Why would the department make some sort of specific order about that? And why would meetings... These are secure areas. The reason that these swipe cards were put in was for a reason to give the tenants privacy and security. But there were a number of complaints from residents on the estate about people who were door knocking. They're, they're not secure. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Minister, but they're, they're not secure. The doors are wide open. I, I live about 20 metres from a, a housing estate. Well, they are secure. They do have to have a swipe card entry. I've been to a number of these high-rise estates. The ones that have a swipe card entry are secure. Okay, they so... They have security guards in the um, in the foyers of these estates. So can Daniel Andrews have his meeting then? The, the, well, let me just finish with the access to the secure areas. Well, we're running out of time. The department, the department reviewed this was because a number of residents complained that people were gaining access to the secure areas to knock on the doors. If people weren't home, they were leaving pamphlets stuffed in their doors and it was drawing attention. Nobody cares about the pamphlets stuffed under my door. I, I... These, these were complaints that the department had from our residents. So at the request of the residents to stop that, the department are enforcing the security of those estates and only people with swipe cards who have access to that area um, or people who are invited in by residents. Wendy Lover, we are fast running out of time and I feel like I've got so many conflicting responses here. First you said there was no ban, now you're saying there is an order. No ban on you're saying that you're not responsible as the Minister for your department, so I, I'm really left quite confused. The department in this policy, because I know that the residents have been complaining about people having access to those secure areas. But I complain about politicians knocking on my door and nobody cares. Well, that's your, your property is your property to manage. Yep. The department's properties are theirs. And your, your property is your department. I'm going to have to leave it there, Minister, because we're coming up to the 9 o'clock news, but I'd love to hear from callers on this 1300...